Hi, we're Lynn and Rowan, and thanks for watching this video presentation of the property. Well, hi folks, and welcome to number 37 Keeper Court in Mount Louisa. Now, we're on the Greenview side of Mount Louisa here today, and I'm sure you're going to be wowed by this property because it is immaculate, beautifully presented, perfectly maintained, and just so well kept and decorated. It's delightful. So it's on a 607 square meter block with a swimming pool. It has four bedrooms, two bathrooms, a double garage, plus some shade, shade cloth over the front for extra um, protection for vehicles parked on the driveway. We've got a couple of different uh, living areas and it's just been finished to a really nice standard or a high standard. It's um, LJ Grady is the builder and it's 230 square meters under roof. So through that, the front door there, we're now into one of the living areas, which is um, a formal lounge. It's got louvers on either side of the, uh, of the picture windows there, looking out to the front. The gardens are beautiful. Okay, so we've got down lights um, through a lot of the home as well. And, um, yeah, high quality, even the built-ins are, are to a higher standard. So this is bedroom four, which is currently used as a multi-use room. We've got a bit of a study and um, some bunk beds in there, but it, it definitely shows the size of the, of the, prop, of the uh, room, for sure. Uh, it's ducted air conditioning throughout as well, and just very nice spaces, beautiful patio outside as well, which we'll get to, and uh, plenty to see inside. So off to the left here, we have the dining area, which is a very good size. That's a six seater dining table there, but there's certainly plenty of room left to move. You've got quality blinds on the windows, insect and security screens. There's one of the ducting points for the air conditioner. That, that's all zoned as well. And you can see that there's extra storage cupboards there as well. Very simple, but lovely quality tile on the floor and that's coming over to the kitchen there as well. So you can see there's a breakfast bar as well, and you've also got this living space also. So coming into the kitchen, the fridge space to my left. Now lots of drawers. There's a ducted stainless steel range hood there as well. Some feature cupboards either side of that range hood. Tiled splashback, but right to the ceiling there. <clears throat> and you've also got the Amiga electric oven there also, and Amiga ceramic cooktop. Pantry cupboards over to the far corner there. And we have a dishwasher, double sinks, and that's got a, a sink an in-sink disposal unit in it as well. And that wrap around breakfast bar there. I'm just going to take you for a quick look into the garage. Now that comes straight in from into the kitchen so it's great for when you bring the shopping home. The floor is finished with an epoxy resin and the clothes dryer there is staying as well because that's ducted into the wall so all of the, um, the heat gets ducted outside. There's some shelving there also. Okay. Now, moving further along into the home, so we've got the rest of the bedrooms and the family bathroom coming up soon. Nice carpets on the floor here. The high ceilings, as I said, the, um, that ducted air conditioning is, is zoned, so you can turn it off in some areas, and there's a couple of split systems as well um, to do the rooms if you don't want the ducting on. Double door built-ins there. And there's your controllers for the ducted air conditioning. Laundry is, um, has got great storage as well. So you've got a double door, sliding door there as well. And also down in your storage cupboards underneath the laundry sink there. Direct access to outside and everything as neat as a pin. So the, um, the tiles have come up halfway up the wall there as well in that, in that separate toilet. Coming into, this is the third of the bedroom, of the four bedrooms that we're going to see here. Now this bedroom and the master bedroom have direct access to outside. So you can see that sliding door access, that goes straight onto that lovely patio. And if I turn around, you'll see again those double, double door built-ins there as well. 
Main bathroom has a huge walk-in shower. Now that's got a shower nozzle at each end and we're tiled all the way to the ceiling there as well. Feature Hollywood lights over the vanity mirror and above basin, above bench basin and there's your vanity basin, vanity bench as well. Okay, last to see inside is the master bedroom, which is a really good size when you see. So there is a split system in this one as well. So if you didn't want to have the ducting on in the bedrooms, you can just have the main, the main bedroom split system on. Same nice uh, carpet on the, on the floors in here. And into the ensuite. So you've got a similar thing with the above bench uh, basins there, but there are double basins as well. You've got the Hollywood lighting above that and your corner shower there also with the toilet tucked away there. Now, uh, as well as that, there is a walk-in robe and that's just in on the other side. So we've got those mirror door, um, mi double mirror doors there that just slide across. So they actually um, conceal the, the ensuite and the walk-in robe. So it just looks like a wall of mirrors, but it's all tucked away behind there. And that's your gl sliding glass door out to outside as well. So as you can see, everything about the home is immaculate, really well maintained. Uh, it was built in 2007, so it's nine years old, but quite seriously, it presents as new. Now, as we go through the sliding doors out to the back patio, you're going to see what a beautiful spot we've got out here to relax and entertain in. So it's uh, probably about 30 square metres, maybe a little bit bigger. It's um, certainly got plenty of room for outdoor settings and fridges and barbecues and all of that sort of thing. But it's also got ceiling fans up and it's fully lined and you've got the down lights there as well. And it looks out to the pool. It's got uh, the same style of tile on the floor. And it's, it catches a lot of breeze here as well. So that's those two rooms there that actually open out onto this area as well as where we've just come through from the dining room. Okay, to the side here, we've got a lovely grassed area. So you've got a nice patch there that leads to the pool. But back this way, we're looking at some double gate access there as well. And then just across to that patio area. And we come across to the lovely pool. So there's gorgeous gardens at the back of the pool there, built up from the um, from the ground level. We've got the uh, terracotta surrounds, which really sets off that nice deep blue colour of the of the pool. There's quite a bit of seating in there as well. Now the pool has all of its certifications as well, so that that gives you a peace of mind. And the other thing with this backyard is all of those. Um, timber fences that you see, all of the pickets there have been double panelled so there's, um, there's certainly a lot of privacy for this backyard as well. And that's just looking back into that patio area again. So to the left here, past the pool, we do have a garden shed and that's got some power to it as well. The, um, the filter equipment for the pool is set in the gardens there and it's got a roof cover over it, also just to protect it. Okay, so down this side here, so you'll see that, the, I mean the home, I've said it several times, but it's just because it, it is so low maintenance and so beautifully maintained. So you can see that it's got that exposed aggregate all down that side makes it easy to get to walk through and there is a single gate at the back but the backyard's lovely so it wraps right around if you had kids or or a pet there's certainly room for, for them to run around in the yard so patios pools beautifully presented four bedrooms two bathrooms double garage lots of living space nice kitchen there's so many things about this home that make it um, certainly desirable and we would love to show you through so if you like what you see we'll be doing open houses but if you'd like to do a private inspection please give us a call or send us an email we can easily do that I just want to show you over here you can see the lovely views of the hill there as well 
lovely and breezy so please yes we'll we'd love to hear from you and we look forward to showing you through so if you're looking to buy or planning to sell please give us a call today we'd love to help you